Dublin is a, a bedroom community to some degree where a lot of people commute to Silicon Valley or the city, um, but yet raise their families here um, because of the quality of life and for our schools. Uh, that means we need to concentrate on bringing large corporations, the, the next Google, I would love to have started by somebody here in Dublin, uh, the next Facebook, the next LinkedIn, the next Twitter, so that they could build their campus here and people could work here because we have so much talent that it lives here, uh, sleeps here, and drives long distances. Um, and uh, it's something that we continue to work with because the big companies want to be in the city. They want to be in Silicon Valley where they have such a large critical mass of, of people um, already in one place. And they are content with putting people on buses. The Google bus, I have friends that ride it. The Facebook bus, I have friends that ride it. Buses, plural. So many buses that they're actually hiring people, bus drivers away from our our transportation authority, we have fewer bus drivers for our own needs because they're hiring them away, and I think it's terrible. Um, but so short of sitting down with um, Mark Zuckerberg, it's hard to say how he is gonna move people to, to Dublin, um, but we've tried, we've pushed hard. We have an economic development team that has attracted uh, companies like Saba Software, like Calidus Cloud, like Ross, like Patelco Credit Union. They've kept companies here, like Braybar, that has thought about moving out uh, one of our top uh, uh, employers. Um, and so we have a great economic development team. It's a micro, uh, macroeconomic decision though that companies make on where to locate. And I think we have some great commercial spots open. Our number one thing to do is to not give that up for residential development. We have some space owned by Alameda County next to the park station. I would like to see corporate office.